Hi, Larry Stewart here with FourConstructionPros.com. I'm at uh, World of Concrete in Las Vegas with Michael Mink, who's uh, the... Tell me your title again, Michael. I am a system specialist with DeWalt Connected Systems. Focused on uh, Focused job site, on site job wireless site today. Wi-Fi, absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Job, job site Wi-Fi is a, a relatively new product for, for DeWalt and kind of unique in the industry. Tell us about how it works. Yeah, so how it works is essentially this is a rugged wireless access point built specifically for the job site or the construction industry. Um, and the way that it works is, is that it leverages the existing internet line that's coming into a job site office or a job site trailer. Mm. So normally on a job site you have an internet service provider who brings internet to the job site trailer. What we do is we plug into that and we extend that bandwidth or that network all across the job site by linking multiple access points all over the job site. So it's essentially a, a Wi-Fi uh, local area network for your job site. It absolutely is. Yeah, yeah it connects a, um, a, a mesh network across the job site okay. and allows uh, you know, users and contractors uh, to have access to the internet no matter where they are on the job site. What kind of expertise does a contractor need to be able to set up a system like this? So actually not a lot and that's really one of the kind of the key things that we built the platform on was simplicity. So we realized that there's not necessarily um, IT engineers or IT professionals on the job site. So what we've done is make a very super uh, simple app, uh, a uh, iPhone application or an Android application that a superintendent or a foreman on the job site can download the app, go out to, uh, to the app store, uh, sync a few units or plug a few units in um, and create a wet, uh, mesh network within a matter of minutes. So very simple. All right. And, and what does a mesh network mean exactly? Uh, it's really just a, a term that's used in terms of how these two devices or how these two units communicate with each other. Okay. Um, and so we do that wirelessly. Mm -hmm. Okay. And right. so mesh is just a term um, that is wireless communication between access points. Huh. We're also kind of enabling other types of technologies on the job site too. So if, uh, if we have a contractor who may be getting into, um, you know, different different types of surveying equipment, or maybe they're utilizing uh, mobile office uh, centers, uh, or they're getting into augmented or mixed reality solutions potentially. So there's a lot of technology that's coming into the job site that we will enable by giving them connectivity to the cloud. Okay. All right. What kind of uh, investment does a, does a contractor make in, in technology like this? How much does it cost to field a system? Sure. It kind of depends on um, the, uh, the the size of the job site. Mm -hmm. So each of these units covers about 10,000 square feet. Um, and so depending on the size of the job, the investment may scale, you know, to uh, to 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 uh, to large, you know, to a large degree, or, or could be, you know, a simple investment. Okay. Um, so each of the units costs uh, fifteen hundred dollars. Um, and again, depending on that, that distance or depending on that size of uh, of a job site, that that the investment is very simple. Practical question I forgot to ask: Is it is it one ten? Uh, you need yes. power. power yep, in? standard power. This is the only. Uh, really Really wired connection that you truly need on the job site. Okay. Um, and again, with the uh, with the way that it adapts and uh, the way that it uh, it can uh, it can self heal itself. If you lose power, you bring it back online, it will connect itself again.